Good evening. Just more than two months after getting slapped with a charge for assault on a police officer, an Albuquerque woman finds herself behind bars again, this time for DWI. Here's News 13's Jeannie Nguyen with what happened. Jeannie. Jackie, you might remember Jasmine Romero as the woman accused of throwing a rock at an officer back in September. Early yesterday morning, she found herself in cuffs again for allegedly driving drunk. According to a criminal complaint, a Bernalillo County Sheriff's deputy noticed Romero's car was parked partially on the road and shoulder at the intersection of Martin Luther King and Broadway. When the deputy got to Romero's car, he could smell alcohol. Romero admitted to the deputy she had one drink, and after doing poorly on a field sobriety test, the deputy arrested her. This comes only two Two months after Romero was arrested for battery on a peace officer, the dramatic police lapel showing she interrupted an officer who was in the middle of a DWI investigation. You are a pig. So I can tell you, so you have pride? I have a female Do you have black pride? Black shirt, black Chasing me? Throwing rocks in my vehicle. Romero was arrested after that incident. On Monday, court documents show she, was, uh, she agreed to complete the young adult court program to dismiss the battery charges. She was arrested for this DWI just four days later. Prior to the battery and DWI charges, Romero had no criminal history here in New Mexico. Jackie, back to you. Okay, thanks, Jeannie. It's still unclear if Romero's DWI will change the outcome of the young adult court program she agreed to complete.